In this video, I'm going to show you how to construct a specific plasmid given the restriction and the nucleus enzyme cut that has been carried out. So the question is asking, um, there was a specific endonuclease BAMHI that has cut the plasma into different four fragments. So it's asking you how many BAMHI sites are there drive possible plasmid maps, okay? Note for every question you have, look, read the question carefully. So it is asking you maps, not a single map. So it means there has, has to be more than different ones. So let me show you how. So then you have a plasma here. So always a sub with the largest base base pair. So you be given two thousand one hundred base pairs. So it's easy. You can be like, okay, then um biggest fragments here, the biggest fragment would be two hundred base pairs, okay. And um I brought my color pen so it makes it easier to read. So that would be one damage I um then so that's we like Four different fragments, I would say four. So we need two more sites. So we have one 800, one 1000, one 1100. So I'm gonna make the 800 to be here. So one more cut, all right? So what else, we have two more, relatively similar weight. So I'm gonna make one more cut in the middle to make a probable two weights, all right? So now we have two fragments right so look so this is done right this is like a possible really good plasma but no it can be more than one i mean look at it so you can have this 800 base pairs to be here let me show you how so you still have your two here right and um this time you will have your 800 to be here right you can have your 800 base pairs to be here and another cut be done there. You can have, um, I don't know, another base pairs be here. Base pairs to be here, right? So still the same, isn't it? You just you just say configuration and shit. Again, you can have the eight hundred to be in the middle. How? Look at that. So it can be like that. Um, it can be eight hundred like that. So then that would be two one base pairs. Then you can have. 100 base pairs here, 1000 base pairs here. Okay, so this is like a probable three different plasma maps you can draw. And so, so in the answer, draw possible plasma, it's been done. How many damage sites are there? I'm gonna say four. Okay, it's easy. Now, next question is asking you, it's doing a double digest. This was a single digest, meaning only one enzyme was used to cut the specific sites. Okay, but here we have another enzyme known as PSTI. Okay, so now it's known as double digest. Okay, it is asking you, okay, we have these fragments being produced after we expose this new enzyme. So what do we do? Okay, one thing I really want you guys to emphasize here is that wherever plasma you go with that fragments have to add up to these weights, okay? So, for example, if there is one 800 base pairs there, the chances are that after you expose it with this enzyme, the 800 base pairs can be here, can be there, or can be there, okay? Just follow the orders. So, let me show you how you can have, um, okay. So, for example, you can have this one plasma here, okay? So note, we don't, we no longer have this 2,100 base pairs. Um, meaning it has been cut. So look, which one of these would give us 2,100? This or this would give us 1,100, so no. One of these and one of those would give us 201 base pairs. So it's easy again because it means there must be a there must be a cut that 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 separated these two. So I would argue, I would say that the PST one side, PSTI, has made a cut in the middle that um um that essentially made um 100 base pairs, for example, here and 1,000 base pairs to be there, giving us 
this, right? It's giving us two one thousand vespers. Do you guys see what I did there? So this adds up to this one, doesn't it? So I'm gonna say there has to be two cuts like that. Okay. Now, so if we have this, we have done two, we need two more. What do we do? Look, look, look carefully around here. Which one have we completed? We have completed this tick. How many fragments else we have? We have one of this left, one of this left, and one of this left. So I'm gonna go construct this up there. So I'm gonna say one cut is there, 800 base pairs there. Then on another side, one more left. So what do you guys think that would be here? Good job. So um, that would be there. Bam, H, I, okay. Giving us that, or giving us that. So look at this plasma and see how similar it is with this, that one. Okay, that's that's the idea here. We trying to give there can't be just single plasma map. There are different arrangements, and I'm not going to show going all through the plasma plasma with this one because I think it's gonna be like I don't know four or six. It can be more than it definitely more than one. So okay. It is much more difficult. So you can have, for example, have um, similar similar thing here. You have you can have that. You can change eight hundred with this one, right? You can you can make it make a cut there. Eight hundred base pairs to be there. Um, one thousand base pairs to be there. Eleven hundred base pairs to be there, right? Still, you have that PSC side here. PSC I side that um, made this base pairs. 1,000 base pairs, right? Okay. And these are BAM HI sites. So it is the idea. All right. While you expose it to double digest, this can happen. And again, this is definitely more than two, but I'm just showing you sample and how to walk through. So for example, you can change these two sites. You can change it to switch these, these two sites and again, play with these fragments to make more replicates. Depending on what the question is asking. If it's asking you to write all the possible plasmids, go for all. But it's chances are that more like your professor asking you like, like to draw three or two. Okay? That's what you do. And there's a plenty of space here to work more. But I just show you this. I just showed you the sample. So and Lastly, it's asking us, okay, we expose it to another restriction enzyme known as node I. But this time it is exposing us to different fragments, okay? No longer we have that um, fragments before, it's so a different fragments. Draw the possible plasmid maps, okay? Again, easy, easy tell out. Look at what it's giving you. Look at what it's giving you. What is that? Right? Easy tell. So you can draw your plasmid like that. Again, what can you do like that? You need to make this, don't you? You need to make that. This is your subheading. This is the order. Sorry, I'm not showing you, sorry. This is your order, right? 2100. 2100. So easy, I don't know, one mark, even if you don't get rest right. This is definitely gonna give you a lot of marks. Right? You have that being done very beautifully. Okay. So you have this plas plasmid. Plasmid. 3100 is being done. What do you do? Tick. Okay. What else have you been given? You have been given three 400 base pairs fragments, one 1K and one 700. So it's very easy. Again, you have to play with the fragments. So. You can um, um, make 800 base pairs down there, how like that. So you're gonna have, you're gonna make one. Uh, also, it's asking you, there's two sides, right? Two sides of this new enzyme. So one node I can be created there, giving us, for example, 400 base pairs here. And um, there can be one, I don't know, BAM HI sites here. And Again, 400 base pairs, giving us a total of 800 base pairs. And what are we given? What are we given? What are we given? Here, 800 base pairs, right? 800 base pairs. Well, well, we have we have we have one left. 
of this and these two. So what do you do? You can, and probably this is a bit too big. Make it a bit small. 400 base pairs is not too big. So you can have... Uh, we need 1100 and 1000, right? We need 1100 and 1000. What do you do? Um, so you're gonna make you're gonna make here one again not eyesight that gives you 400 base pairs and one another side this is really terrible sorry this is really too small but I think you get the vibe here so that's one another damage side that gives you 700 base pairs filling you up the 1100 base pairs and lastly we've been given last one fragment this is 100 one 1000 base pairs okay look 1100 base pairs 1000 base pairs 800 base pairs to 2100 base pairs matching you this one okay oh sorry this one now you can play with this make it to be look like this one how so again i'm going to quickly go through it not going to draw all the plasmids so you can have that here you, you'll have your 200 ba base pairs like that you can have one not eye size i don't have much time left so i'm going to be quick so you can have 400 base pairs like that you can have um one bam h size like that they give you 400 base pairs you can have um um i can have um um 700 here base pairs but not i you can have another BAM H side like that. BAM H side like that gives you 400 base pairs and this gives you 1000 base pairs. So giving you a total of here 1100 base pairs, 1000 base pairs and 800 base pairs. Extremely sorry if it looks so messy. I don't have much time left because I have to end it because my phone drive is about to end. So. I hope you get a vibe here. There are six different plasmids you can make with this one. I don't have a time to go through all of them. I hope you make I hope you can go through all of them. Ask me a question in the comment section. If you stuck with this, please ask me a question and I'm more than happy to help you. Thank you so much for watching and have a good night.